emotional time to be in law enforcement as a black man. Interesting time to be a black man in America. Our deputies and law enforcement officers across our country are dealing with some big challenges day in and day out. When these situations happen, we have to challenge them. We have to address them. We have to be forceful in making sure that those things don't represent our area or our police force or our subset. We have to hold each other accountable. The riotings and, and the way society has taken a different view towards us in law enforcement, it's had a big effect. You know, you go to help a person, no matter what color they are, but it hurts even more that you're trying to help people of color. And as a result of that, you're getting belittled. For me, it's about protecting and serving those that can't speak for themselves. That's what it's about. It's about helping the community. It feels like you're loved on one half of the spectrum, but on the other half, you're hated just because you are a law enforcement officer as a black man. And I just feel that that burden has a weight that's indescribable. But I think for us to try to draw from our minority employees and deputies and to hear what are you, what are you feeling, what are you thinking, help us navigate through this difficult time. Even though as a law enforcement officer, they're flashing these images at you constantly and you start to look at it and say, wow, there is another deceased black man at the hands of the police. So as a black man, you, you get very conflicted as to what your job is and how to handle it. That's not the way the majority of law enforcement works. That's not the way that the majority of law enforcement is trained. There are bad apples, yes, but it's not who we are. I don't stand for injustice either. I don't stand for racism either. I don't stand for police brutality either. And when I have these encounters and I'm put in that box, sometimes it feels like you can't get out.